when I go to Come on in. you weigh 11 pounds huh <laughs> oh <laughs> what's up guys welcome back to the channel you spill <laughs> can i redo that nope okay anyways guys welcome back to the channel i want to go over my weigh-ins with you early this morning so i want to show you guys what last week looked like. I started at 148 and I dropped a couple pounds and then I stayed the same for a little while. Now I'm at 144.8. So what is that? Four pounds? I lost four pounds altogether, which is pretty good if I weren't in a rush to get, you know, if I weren't in a rush to lose weight before Hawaii. So I'm going to drop my calories 200. Mm. Yeah, by 200. So hopefully by next week I can lose another like three-ish pounds, which is quite a bit. But today I weighed in at 144.8. Hopefully by the end of the week I'll be around 141 or 140. I'm going to put my macros up on the screen so you guys can kind of get an idea of what I'm eating to lose weight and what, you know, my fats, carbs, and proteins are. But this morning I'm going to have my coffee and then I just weighed out my creamer. I use the Natural Bliss Coffee Mate Vanilla. And so I just did two servings of that. Coda, what are we going to have for breakfast, baby? Coda already ate his breakfast, but then he decided to throw it up. I think I'm just going to have a bagel with turkey and Swiss and call that a morning. It, since I'm going to be lowering my calories, I know I'm going to get a lot hungrier. Guys, when you diet and you drop calories, it is so normal to be hungry. I feel like it's my body's way of saying that it's using, you know, stored fat for energy. So I can tell when I'm like losing weight. I know that sounds weird, but I can tell when I'm hungry. I feel like, you know, it's using the stored energy I have. So it's okay to be hungry. It's extremely normal when you're losing weight so don't think you need to feel full all the time but i need to wake up with my coffee even though it's decaf and um we'll be going on our day Devon shop right now and I am so excited to show you guys all the goodies we have for Gary if you guys don't follow Devon's channel then you guys probably haven't seen exactly what we're gonna be doing to my STI here in a few weeks I am so freaking excited and all the parts are at the shop right now and I want to show you guys they're not all laid out but I mean you can see them on the shelf so I want to show you guys that and I was planning on washing my STI but, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's starting to rain outside. I feel like it hasn't hit me yet though because we haven't actually, like we can't do it right now because Devin is busy with his Evos currently. We have a lot of stuff we're doing to the car. I might steal some of Devin's footage and just put it up on the screen so you guys can get a better look at what we're doing to my STI. But the main reason I came over here was to freaking wash my car. I mean, she looks clean at all times just because of the color of it, but this car is actually super dirty right now. Let's see. Which I never let my car really get like, oh, that's really dirty. Wait, wait. Oh. Speaking of 
of the devil. The setup on the car is going to be DW1500, the DW brushless pump, DW regulator, ETS turbo kit, rotated with the 5858 ball bearing, ETS front mount, ETS interfluid piping, ETS man header or manifold, ETS cat back, ETS everything. V deletes, Grim Speed 3 port, flex fuel, stock motor for now until we blow it up and then we'll send it. That's the gist. We got the exhaust. We have the intercooler, intercooler piping, manifold, down pipe, up pipe. This is a, this looks like an open dump. It is, dump tube for the wastegate. I didn't know I was doing open dump. I'm just scared because I remember how my Evo sounded on an it's open a, dump. It's a Subaru, it's different. Oh, okay, we have the mufflers, and then I'm gonna have to name her. What are you gonna name her? I don't know yet. Maybe Trish the turbo. <laughs> We're still waiting on a lot of parts to start this build, but these are the TGV deletes from Radium. for the last like four five days is walking up this giant mountain top and here and there Devin will make me jog starting and we're about to jog right now I just got done with leg day I didn't record it but I got done with leg day and you know that feeling where they feel like bricks that's me and I'm dying come on let's run Come on, Bob. Dog it out. Oh shit, I'm fat. Good job. Now let's go watch the sunset. That's the only reason, well, there's a couple reasons, but that's one of the reasons it's worth it. It's that view. But legit guys, I wasn't kidding, it's like a mountaintop. <laughs> 